Hi, I'm Chris Hawkins, and today we're going to talk about point cloud organization with Trimble RealWorks. So we've got RealWorks open, and we have a project uh, cloud open of our office. You can see uh, we have the first floor, and on the back side we have our warehouse. Now, I mean, for something this small, you're probably fine with uh, just keeping everything organized in just one large cloud. But uh, as you move across uh, deliverables, and you might need to push this out into uh, other software formats, you know, such as Recap or maybe even E57, um, it starts you know, to behoove you to organize uh, per area, per se, even per floor, or per department, however you want to go about it. But it's, it's, it really helps with uh, opening and closing things up, you know, file size transfers, so on and so forth. So in this regard, we're going to jump through that and, uh, and show you how easy it is to accomplish. So we're going to uh, take a look at a top-down view, and uh, it's as easy as selecting your actual cloud and hitting the segmentation tool in the edit menu. We've got different types of geometries we can use to segment. Um, since we got a, well, we got pretty much a rectangular shape, so we're just going to go ahead and use the rectangular rectangle tool. I'm going to come up here. Click once, zoom out, click outside the main office area, and type I, or I could hit the checkbox up here. Let me go ahead and check the checkbox. That means I'm going to keep that cloud in this current segmentation that I'm generating. So simply by drawing a box in plan view, we've segmented out our office portion from the entire cloud. I'll hit the Create button, which will then create a new cloud component down here. And then now I also have my warehouse sitting by itself after it's segmented the office portion. So I can click Create on that as well. So now I have new Object 49 and Object 50. I can go ahead and close out of my segmentation tool, come down and rename these just for sake of organization. And just like that, I now have full control over what's being displayed between my warehouse and my office. Now, as simple as that is inside of RealWorks, the true power starts coming when we want to export this out. And so I can either just you know, uh, select one of these and come up to home, export, export selection, and then whether I'm going to spit this out to Recap, if you have uh, Recap Pro, or I can spit this out to E57 or any other you know, slew of formats. Um, um, file size is always of the essence, and you really need to pay attention to that, or you could have a, a really long day you know, transferring uh, 50 gigabytes of one big cloud. So if you'd like to learn more, please check out our YouTube channel or contact your local Building Point rep. Thanks for watching.